Well, it's not always the case that an actor who leaves the show mm. is fired. Double. Sometimes that's exactly the case. So in this video, we'll look at 10 South African actors who allegedly got fired for bad behavior. But before we get into it, don't forget to subscribe and leave a comment down below for topic you'd like us to cover in the future. Number 10. Mushendigi. Sometimes, despite doing a great job, you could lose your job for the drama in your personal life as companies just don't like being associated with negative publicity. Mushendigi can attest to this fact. The actor who also dabbles as a comedian was recently fired from the set of Gomorrah where he was playing the role of Fagu. Although both Mushendigi and the producers of Gomorrah have not commented on his alleged dismissal, sources believe that his role was written off. This was after Mushendigi was caught up in an assault case where popular Twitter commentator Musa Kaula accused him of physically assaulting him. Number 9. Vendam Tlongo while it's not perfectly clear if Brenda Mklongo was fired or she left for other reasons, we do know that the actress was allegedly fired by the Imbeu team for allegedly choking one of the producers. The sources of such news are very unreliable and thus we consider this a hoax and probably a deliberate attempt to tarnish Mklongo's name. However, other sources reveal that she may have left the show for other opportunities or because she wasn't happy with the role she was playing, with others even suggesting she wasn't paid enough. So which one do you think it is? Do you think Brenda would choke the producers or was someone just trying to get at her? Number 8. Mpumelelo Bulosa Right here is a full controversial man. Award winning musician and actor Mpumelelo Bulosa is one heck of a controversy. The man is very talented indeed, however in most production teams he has worked with, he seems to have a recurring problem of being fired. In his last role on ATV's In Bay With The Seed, the actor was fired for bad behavior according to one of the producers. Apparently the man would come to the filming set late and he would disrespect directors by, you know, directing himself and stuff. Because why not? So obviously everyone loves this behavior and so he got fired. And even after trying to get him back, the man was very much still difficult as some have so kindly put it. Prior to the Imbewu 18, the actor was fired from Uzalo for pretty much the same reasons. So while he's a great talented actor, his alleged arrogance probably needs to be toned down a notch or two. Number 7. Lituli Lamini Okay, so this guy is an absolute blast. The guy was playing Stan on ETV Scandal when he got aged. And you're probably wondering why they prefer such a lovely guy. Well, you would be surprised. According to reports close to the source, the actor was very difficult to work with as he would come late to work. And if you're wondering where he would be at the time, Nitulu was allegedly found to be spending most of that time at Brookdale's. And that obviously didn't make the scandal team pleased at all. So they asked him, and even after resolving the matter, the scandal team wasn't very willing to bring him back to their set. Number 6. SK Koza Well, this guy is also kind of controversial. Firstly, he's had various training videos on Twitter for all the wrong reasons, with some even speculating that he was bewitched. After all that, Tim Sokoza was also allegedly abusive towards his partner and that's kinda where the hit got too much for his work. According to News24, as a result of abusive allegations from his fiancée Mandy Shlomwani, SK Koza was aged from the Queen and in response to the allegations, SK didn't deny being abusive, though he only limited the abuse to emotional abuse and nothing else. However, his girlfriend reported that the actor had assaulted him with the intent to cause grievous bodily harm. SK said he had been subconsciously taking out his problems on Mandy instead of working on the in a fair manner and as a result unintentionally abused Mandy emotionally. Regardless of the matter, the guy was aged and we only hope there will be less controversies from the talented actor as many love to see him on the screens. Right now you can watch him on the black door which airs on ETV every day at 22 hours. Number 5. Mbule Lundla Zilwana Speaking of brothels, this guy literally got fired after he was found at one. Bulele used to play the role of Stella on ETV Scandal, a role he sadly had to leave very early on. Well, here's what happened. For some reason, Bulelo was at a brothel with some friends. Then the police raided the place and arrested the man who were allegedly responsible for getting women into such adult houses. And among those arrested was Mbulelo there. Even though Mbulelo insisted he was innocent, the scandal team was still on time in exiting him. And ever since, though, there hasn't been another appearance of Stella on Scandal. And they don't seem keen in bringing him back. But on the brighter side, he got roles on other shows and even finished his degree. Number 4. Dinewa Langa You may have seen Langa from various TV shows including The Queen and The Estate as well as ETV Scandal as Nalindi Langa. Dinewa Langa is one of the actors who was fired not for bad behavior per se but because she had asked for a 3 months break from The Queen as she had a movie to shoot in that period. In response to that, The Queen creators fired her. While this rumor was confirmed by Dinewa Langa herself on Instagram, the figure since denied ever firing anyone although it was in a broader sense rather than in reference particularly to Dinewa. 
Dextro's character was killed off just a few months after that Instagram confirmation. However, in that time period, Dina was confirmed to be on the payroll. Number 3. Fundi Swazwani Sometimes standing up for yourself can yield great results. However, in most cases, it's not usually the case. And so was the case with Fundi Swazwani. When the actress was still portraying the role of Gamadon Salon in Bay with the Seed, she ran into a problem with the money she was paid, which resulted in a possible dispute between her and her agency. So her agent allegedly protested on her behalf for a salary increase and that didn't work so well as she got fired as a result of that. The actress was well loved and fans had already grown fond of her and had developed a great bond for her character. Number 2. Hongani Love when Hungani left Scandal, a lot of rumors spread about the various reasons he left the show. The initial speculation was that he had left because he was underpaid. However, Scandal denied ever underpaying Hungani. In fact, there are sources that suggest the actor was promised up to 88,000 rands to stay. However, due to unknown disputes, the actor left allegedly at his own will, meaning he wasn't fired. After a few months, his character was reprised, but that was short-lived and he disappeared again. Ever since, other actors surrounding the Newtonian narrative were slowly removed from the show and replaced with new storylines. It's important to note that there was a rumor that Hungani had left because the environment was toxic, a similar claim to that of non Makanya. So maybe there's a bit of truth in that rumor, but I guess we will never know. Thus far, it seems we may never see Hungani on Scandal again. However, you may see him on other soapies in other TV shows. Number 1. non Makanya Nomvelo Makanya is a South African actress best known for playing the role of Nindiwe on ETV Scandal. She recently left the show in November 2020 and left fans shattered as she left her premature baby and baby dead in Klamalo alone. While her exit was pretty sad, the news reports surrounding her exit were very controversial. Firstly, prior to her exit, there were already news reports circulating about her exit saying she was leaving the show because of her boyfriend. Yes, her boyfriend. Apparently, the guy was uncomfortable with his scenes with Nsamu and wanted her to exit the show because of that. These reports made fans outrageous, but they were obviously not true as Nonvelo later responded to them in a tone rage saying, at this point, you can believe whatever you want. I left because I wanted to dress an actress. While well, the false reports should have ended here, they didn't. Nonvelo Makana was later reported to have revealed the scandal was a toxic and abusive environment. In what way, we absolutely don't know. However, it may seem that she left the show because she was mistreated by the team. While some believed her story, citing the exits of Fungani Ndlovu, Tsepo Moses and many others, some just didn't buy it at all, saying Novel was making it up. So what do you think about her exit? And that will be all for today. Please subscribe and leave a comment down below on a topic you would like us to cover in future. Thank you for watching.